Hello guys, my name is Yolita Brilliant, I'm the owner of Brilliant Massage and Skin Care and today I wanted to make a video of uh, passive ways of uh, you could make money and um, I'm going to share what I have done and what I'm still working on to bring this passive income into my life. So uh, the first thing would be the real estate property and I've always wanted to have it and uh, now we have a fourplex and um, I don't believe in one door homes because you know if something happens you lose your job you're stuck with paying everything by yourself um, so if, once you're ready to buy a home I highly recommend looking into duplex, triplex or fourplex if you want to buy more than that then it would be commercial loan but you know with residential loan you can get up to four units that's what we have and our mortgage is completely covered by tenants and if you know you buy like a little bit distressed property inside I don't recommend buying like a horribly distressed especially as your first property but you can buy like an outdated property and make it nice and modern and then you can attract not good tenants now later you could like flip homes too if you're like good with renovations and stuff like that but you could just buy um um good enough property where you don't have to do that much work but maybe more cosmetic work and i'm sure i um, guarantee um it's not that hard to do we did it and now it's gonna you know bring in passive income for the next forever you know um, as long as the house is stands here um, so it's super helpful another passive income well my main job is my spa but if you create services business kind of like actually even the spa potentially could become like a passive income if you hire all the duties out then you don't really have to be there not at least every day you know to do the things so like services or like being a business owner you know not just like online business like a real business owner it also gives you flexibility now if sometimes business owners are working you know 12 hours a day and i used to do that you know to get it going and stuff like that you need to do that but later you know you shouldn't do that you should be the business owner and you should hire a lot of the work out and um, if you hire well your business will be successful and you can learn how to do that the other way for passive income is um, investing into stocks you know i feel like everyone should invest no matter how much you make try to put aside at least some money to invest um, i personally use vanguard because it's low fee there's not a lot of load uh, fees when you put the money in um, and I personally invest in uh, EFT. Um, I don't invest in individual stocks because if, if some if one stock goes down, you still have other ones. So what I invest is in like um, target date funds or S and P five hundred or ETFs like technology ETF. Let's say where it has different companies in that stock like Tesla, um, Apple, um, you know Amazon, whatnot. So if one of them don't do well, others will still do hopefully well and you know it's passive you, I don't worry about ups and downs I don't day trade you know I'll take it out when it, I bought low I'll take it out when it's high if I need it when I need it from when I retire 30 years from now or not the other thing the same as you can invest with cryptocurrencies you know I bought Bitcoin when it was low and now it's I bought it during the quarantine and it was like three thousand and now it's 9,000. I also bought it when it was at 100 and then it went up. So I wish I bought more, but I didn't know better back then. Um, you know, I was silly and young. <laughs> but anyways, um, especially now with the quarantine, you know, people realize how important it is to have those savings, that passive income coming in. So um, next up is Amazon FBA, actually selling on Amazon. Like eBay, yeah, I don't really, I don't want to mess with that or like arbitrage, but um, you could still do that. You could buy used stuff, sell it on Amazon. I'm sorry, sell it on Facebook or eBay or whatnot, marketplace. But what uh, actually the best thing to do is to sell private label. 
you know, create a product, see where there's a need, and there's tools to find those products, like Helium 10 or Jungle Scout, I'm actually going to post down below. And once you um, determine their search volume, like there's Merchant Words, also another app, um, see how many people searching for the thing, and if there is enough need, but not enough products there, or you can innovate and bring something new, you're going to sell. Um, so sell on Amazon FBA, you just send out a product there and they ship it for you. They do everything for you. Uh, so it's really also like, yes, you do need work. You need to source products and stuff like that. Up front, there's a lot of work, but eventually it could become passive income, kind of like the services income that I mentioned. You could um, have it going and even hire out to VA, maybe handle some stuff if you want. But probably wouldn't even need that need that because Amazon handles a lot and that's what I'm working on. I don't have that yet and I'm working actually on our first products right now. This 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 time. I'm gonna update you how it goes. But um the other thing you could do simpler Amazon affiliate sales, what you could do if you have a blog um, or something you're passionate about, you could talk about it, you could write about it online and you can put links in there and people when they buy anything within 24 hours after they click the link you're gonna get a little commission and I used to have that and I stopped blogging now I picked it up again so I have to kind of start from scratch and but I made 10 bucks so far you know I'm eventually when I have enough links added to my blog or I maybe I'll make a couple hundred or someone from them you know so it's not like a lot of money from an unless you really have a very popular blog that people go in and then but you know if it's like a niche you could find like an extra income now there are things like YouTube as well you know if you are good um, on camera and you want to do reviews you could um, view products put the link there that people could buy as well let's say with Amazon affiliate link or books or like you know, or software and um or you could have youtube channel about anything and then monetize it you know with advertiser videos so not just affiliate way to make money on youtube but also you know i used to have my channel monetized but i just came back recently making videos again so i hope to get that back once i get the more watch hours please subscribe and like that would be really helpful um, so yeah, like you did, you know, you can make videos, do reviews, or do education, um, business, beauty, those are niches that have, um, how I usually per click, um, pay, you know, you get paid pretty good from advertisers and those niches. And as well, Instagram, you know, if you like taking pictures, and you post nice, very well done pictures, um, brands could pay you. To feature you know their product in your picture that's another way to for extra that's not really that passive it's not really passive but maybe an extra income sort of like if you take pictures if you enjoy doing that then why not you know so I think that's it um, let me know guys if you have any questions post them in the comments down below and um, don't forget to click that like button and um, I'm on Instagram at Yolita Brilliant and as well my website is YolitaBrilliant.com if you want to um, coach you want to look for anything like I was like what I was talking about any questions post them down below and I'll try it I'll make sure I answer I'll, I will answer it so have a brilliant day